Hey Omni Dogs and Omni Kittens, it's Omni Dog here talking to you about my haul for Record Store Day, which I went to. Uh, I stood in line for an hour and a half. Um, it was a pretty slow moving line, but it was very well organized. I went to Crooked Beat Records in Alexandria, Virginia. Um, great service, great place. I'd been there a little bit, a uh, few times before. Um, they were sold out. I, I didn't get there till about 10.30. They opened at 10. People had been waiting in line overnight. That ain't me. So I'm not going to do that. So it was almost a given that the stuff I really had my eye on that they were getting one copy of was going to be gone. But I still managed to get some cool stuff that I really did want. Uh, the first thing I got was the 7-inch Led Zeppelin record release. Remixes of Rock and Roll and Friends. And it came on colored vinyl, which I love. So that is the thing that I wanted. I got that. Very happy about that. It's really cool. The next thing I got was from one, from one of my favorite groups back in the 80s. Uh, you may uh, know or not know that I'm a huge fan of punk rock. That's right. I used to be in the mosh pit for about 10 seconds and then I would get out of it and just watch the band. But it would be Circle Jerks called Gig. It's a live recording. I never got to see them live. I got to see groups like the Dead Kennedys and Black Flag live, but I didn't get to see the Circle Jerks live. So this was really cool. I can hear them uh, live. This is a live recording. And this was from Record Store Day and I'm very happy I got this. Uh, the thing I'm most happy about is that I got the Neil Young Tonight's the Night Live at the Roxy album. Uh, it comes with Record Store Day Edition, contains an exclusive photo print of Neil Young and the Santa Monica Flyers. I consider myself a very knowledgeable Neil Young fan. I thought I was not aware of the Santa Monica Flyers. Um, I, I, uh, I, I, bleh, I just didn't know about them. And so I'm very excited that there was still a copy of this in the store. I know there were probably a ton of copies made, but uh, this was the one thing I had my eye on. I love his live music, and um, it's great to have, have this in my collection. Another group that I love... I love uh, shoegaze music from the 90s, and this is Catherine Wheel, um, a British group, I'm, and I have to say I'm not familiar with this album either. I, ha I have a bunch of their albums, but I just wasn't familiar with this one, and it may, it may not be traditional shoegaze, it may be the, kind of their more metallic sound, their more black metal kind of music they moved into. Um, but I don't care. I, I like all their music, and I'm really looking forward to seeing it. Seeing it. I'm looking forward to listening to it. Um, and then uh, that was it for Record Store Day exclusives. But while I was there, I said, I stood in line for an hour and a half. I better get some other stuff, too. And so I got my Bloody Valentine album called Things Left Behind. I don't have any Bloody Valentine on uh, vinyl, so I was really happy to get my first vinyl. Uh, everything I have is on CD from them. Uh, I'd love to get more vinyl, but I think a lot of it's out of print and expensive, so I was really psyched to get this. And then a group that not many people know about, but maybe some of you out there know about them, called A Place to Bury Strangers. This is my kind of modern music, and it came on colored vinyl. Woo! Um, if you haven't heard them, give them a listen on uh, you know SoundCloud or, or sample it on iTunes or uh, however you listen to music. A Place to Very Strangers. I really like it. It's really cool music. So that was my haul for Record Store Day. That's It's not much considering I stood in line for an hour and a half and other people left with like $500 worth of albums. I mean, they went crazy. And there's going to be, I think there are two a year. There's going to be another one, I guess, in the fall. 
I will be much more prepared for that one. I am going to have a list out. Now that I know how it works, I'm going to go in there and I'm just going to lay it out, going to get there earlier and maybe bring a chair so I don't have to stand. So hope you had a good record store day and got what you wanted. Uh, feel free to leave in the comments section what you got if you uh, went to record store day. So uh, until then, thanks for watching. Peace and love, peace and love. Feel free to subscribe and I usually answer all comments. So thanks a lot. Take care.